Recently, I've had several requests to do a caregiver tip on how to help Kiki through the loss of a loved one. Now, this is no easy feat in a very short video clip, but I do honor its importance, especially for those who have lost loved ones during COVID-19. It's very hard to find the right words when you're grieving. And sometimes we say things like, Tutu passed on, or Tutu is resting in peace. But our Kiki's brains process things literally. So Tutu passing on or resting in peace paints that exact picture in your Kiki's mind. So try your best to be as literal as possible when talking about death and dying with your Kiki. You can say, Tutu's body is all power working now. And that's part of living on Earth. Even Stella, our doggy, she'll start to get older and her body will stop working one day too. And that's why it's so good to just enjoy each other and laugh and share aloha. So we have lots of good memories of the people and doggies that we love. Keeping things truthful and simple creates a strong safety net for Kiki. If having these conversations are just too difficult right now, I also wanna share this wonderful Kiki book that you can read together. It's called The Goodbye Book by Todd Parr. It's simply put and comforting. Rent it from your library and keep it out on your coffee table for Kiki to look through. Being honest with your Kiki about losing a loved one may be one of the hardest conversations you may have to have, but it's also one of the most important. You've got it.